Hello, good morning friends. Today I am going to discuss about growth of mental symptoms. In previous video we discussed about importance of mental symptoms, definition, source and origin. So today topic is growth of mental symptoms. According to aphorism 9 of Organon of Medicine, our master Hanuman says, in dwelling region, gifted mind can freely employ this living organism. What is indwelling? Indwelling means permanent present in someone's mind and souls. Dwelling means the space or place where a person lives or a house. So indwelling region, gifted mind can freely imply this living organism. Thus we learn that the main function of mind is to imply the living organism. The mind takes cognizance of an impression produced upon brain by any of the five senses. The imply the living organism to imply the living organism the mind takes cognizance. Cognizance means detailed knowledge about or understanding something and impression means an idea, a feeling or an option that you get about somebody. So the mind takes cognizance of an impression produced upon brain by any of the five senses. When brain receives an impression from some source, mind becomes conscious. Conscious state or conscious means able to see, hear, feel, etc. Mind becomes conscious of it and then there is formed within the mind what is called perception. The power of perceiving, the power of perceiving and comparison is called intelligence. The power of perceiving and comparison is called intelligence. The intelligence is mind's faculty of knowing. After receiving, after receiving various and repeated impressions and after forming repeated comparison of an object of objects an automatic function is developed. After receiving various and repeated impressions and after forming repeated comparison of object an automatic function is developed. This is known as intuition. This is known as intuition. It is an incomplete knowledge. It is an incomplete knowledge and thus the faculty of thought is stirred into activity. Intuition is an incomplete knowledge and thus the faculty of thought is stirred into activity. What is thought? Thought is the elaborative faculty, the comparative faculty, the faculty of relationship. Thought is the elaborative faculty, the comparative faculty, the faculty of relationship. Reasoning. Reasoning occurs as a result of fighting of different thoughts and concluding in either victory or defeat. Any thought or result concluding either victory or defeat is reasoning. Judgment. Judgment is the verdict of the whole matter after the proper reasoning. Will is the power of determination upon final action 
and upon the will human activities largely depends so we can sketch the action of intellectual mind as follows impression consciousness perception intelligence intuition thoughts reasoning understanding will and judgment impression consciousness perception intelligence intuition thoughts reasoning understanding will and judgment so this is a sketch the action of intellectual mind in this way we see the growth of the mental symptoms so in three video we able to understand what is importance of mental symptoms definition source and growth the next video is development of mental symptoms thank you for watching this video